Hello everybody, my name is JP the Minecart and today I'm going to be showing you guys and this is just for everybody out there that's a YouTube content creator or a small one and is trying to grind their way up and has come across this issue. Russian bots. If you have come across Russian bots in your live chat and you're getting really tired of it and having to manage them all the time, hide them, delete the messages, all that stuff, I got a solution for you. Now this solution does require a stream bot. You could either use Streamlabs, Stream Elements, or Nightbot. For this video, we're going to be using Streamlabs. So, first things first, in Streamlabs, you want to locate CloudBot. Now, if this is your first time ever using this uh, bot ever, because if you've never used Streamlabs or Stream Elements or anything like that, make sure you copy this uh, link here and add it as a moderator. To do that, you need to go to YouTube Studios, go to the community, in the settings and then add this as a moderator that way this bot is a moderator and can manage everything okay once you do that you want to go into word protection all right once you're in word protection you can customize how you want your uh message to notify the people hey this is not allowed or anything like that you can customize that how you want for this uh for mine i have it set to the username saying sorry that's not allowed here because in my blacklist i actually have a word I don't allow in my live chat that word is mod now that purges that does not ban someone but as you can see right here these are all the ones I put in so if most of yours are looking somewhat like this basically when this event ever happens copy the message put the message here set it to ban save and then you manually do it and if another bot does it and does that exact same message it will automatically ban them now I've had two here which is right here that I'm not for sure they are officially ru uh, Russian bots or not. They most likely, but for now I have them set to purge. And what purge does is purge is basically deletes a message. It kind of takes a timeout, but it does a timeout for one second, deletes the message and what they sent before. But it, it only times them out, so then from after it, they can continue chatting. Ban basically, what ban does, it basically hits the user. So the Russian user gets automatically hit in your channel. You no longer will expect any stuff from that user. But that doesn't mean you're not going to expect the same thing. You'll probably expect it from a different Russian uh, bot. So this is kind of how I have it set up here. It's very simple, very easy to do. Uh, I would totally recommend this. This is a very quick, short video. Uh, but uh, I will go ahead and show you how to we add this to the uh, our, uh, moderation deals. Okay, so this here is your YouTube Studio dashboard. Now, what you want to do is you want to locate the settings down here. Once you locate the settings, go into Community. When you go into Community, right here where it says Moderations, you would paste this link right here, and then you would see Streamlabs there. I also have it as Approved User, so you can see some of my hid users that has had a hid, but that's how you set that up. So that's very simple indeed. That's pretty much it for this. That's a it's a real quick video, kind of explaining how you can prevent this from happening. And don't guarantee that this is gonna work 100% because, like I said, every Russian bot will probably say something different. Now, there's probably a way I can set this up to where, if it looks somewhat similar to it, it would take care of it. But I don't do that just because I'm afraid a normal message it would target that normal message. So I don't want to do that. So that's how come I have this set up because. It's just easier so like see most of these are all the same like these two right here the same it's just they have they've changed the r the m to capital r and then they change the r and d capital they're both slow they're mostly the same but the, everything is always different like this one's somewhat the same they they flip them a lot and it gets very annoying so but it's easy enough to add it and the next time they try to attack and they use one of the same ones that's in this list they got and taken care of. They got taken care of by Streamlabs. But yeah, it's definitely worth doing this. So yeah, um, hopefully this did help you out. Um, then, like I said, you can try this out with uh, Streamlabs, uh, Stream Elements, and Nightbot. I know how to do Streamlabs because it's the one I use. I don't use Nightbot. I don't use Stream Elements. I used to use those in the past, but I just stick with Streamlabs. But yeah, hopefully this helps you out. Like I said, very quick video how to take care of Russian bots uh, if you don't want to see them no more in your live chat. Now, I've never had this issue before in comments. I've only had this issue in live chat. So if you're having this issue in live chat, 
hopefully this video helped you out but uh yeah if you guys uh did enjoy this video make sure you give a like if you're new to the channel make sure you hit the subscribe button i don't normally make a lot of these tutorial videos on stuff and stuff like that but i figured i'd make this one just to help a lot of people out that have been struggling with this because i thought i was the only one having this but i found out another youtuber i know is having this issue so i figured i'd make this video but uh yeah if you did like it like i said make sure you give a like if you're new to the channel make sure you hit the subscribe button uh, like I said, I don't make a lot of these uh, type of videos, but if you want to hit the notification bell, that way you don't miss any of the gameplay videos I do, such as Emergency Response of Rigid County, which is on Roblox, and any type of other Roblox games on Minecraft. But apart from that, I've been your host, Chip in the Minecart. Hopefully this video was helpful to you, and you've been the audience, and I will see you all next time. Goodbye, everybody!